Alright, what's up guys? It's Daniel here with another pickups video. This time a Dollar Tree pickup. And it is not that many films. I did do there after, you know, I went after Black Friday and my Dollar Tree had just put out their movies. So I was able to get a few. There wasn't too many. There was a lot of repeat titles and titles I already had. But I did pick up a few and as well as I've been told that a family member picked up some for me also for Christmas. So hopefully we didn't get the same ones. But either way, first one I found was uh, Trick or Treat. I have not heard of or seen of this one. So this was new there. So I said, you know what? Pick this one up. And a replacement copy for Anchorman for Buck. I mean, come on. This next one, I already popped in a watch and was a complete shit show. Doll faces. It is about a young woman who inherits a house from her grandmother along with her massive doll collection. And the stipulation is she must take care of the dolls the way she takes care of the dolls. But the fucked up thing is, this chick does not talk. There's, there's, there's audio coming out of her speaking, but she does not move her mouth. So I don't know what the hell that was about. And yeah, these dolls are just weird. And yeah, but for a buck, I'm not that pissed off about it, but if I had paid more than a buck, I would have been really pissed off. So just warning, if you see this one and you're thinking a uh, uh, puppet master, no, that's what I was thinking. That was my, my dumb ass fault for thinking that. But yeah, I mean, watch it. Let me know what you think if you haven't or you've seen it. Yeah, it was, to me it was a complete shit show. And then I picked up the house at the end of the street. This was a, copy they had of this one in about six boxes that were put out so yeah and I have not seen this one so for a buck hell yeah and this one too I have not seen I've heard good things about it John dies at the end so yeah I'm looking forward to popping this one in as well as house at the end of the street but as far as that doll face, that was some, that was some, I would say, some BS and a half. But yeah, um, you know, I just, I was hap I happened to walk into Dollar Tree to pick up some stuff, and you know, the the boxes were out on the shelves, pristine, no copies missing out of out of any of the boxes. So I was able to uh, go through them, and yeah, there was a lot of MGM classic. The, the reprints of them but nothing that I needed nothing that drew my attention so yeah you know I'm gonna go back and check out see if they put out anything because uh, as far as I know my Dollar Tree that's literally down the street from me they've been having a, a rough time with freight coming in so I think that's why because the, to the store was tore up with boxes everywhere and you know, the, they were restocking and all that good stuff. So I think that's why I was able to catch these uh, when I did. Fortunately, I wish there was more titles that I could have gotten because I've seen uh, seen some people say they've picked up Wolf Cop 1 and 2 as well as uh, the new Puppet Master, uh, that the latest one. So yeah, I was kind of hoping I could score some of those, but no dice. But let me know if you picked up any cool things at the Dollar Tree. And, you know, be sure to like the video and follow me on social media as well as the channel. You know, like I said before, got a lot of stuff brewing as well as, uh, you know, some exciting things I'm looking forward to. So, you know, be sure to, to follow me to check it all out. Till next time. See ya.